Hello everyone and welcome to this quick tutorial video. So today I'm going to show you how to change your autofill information on your iPhone. So if you've ever been in Safari and you need to type in your name and email and address and all that information and it autofills incorrectly or you would like for it to autofill. So for example, here we are in a form and right here where it says my name, the autofill information comes up down here on my keyboard. I just tap into that, go to email and then my home email comes up here and all that information is just easy to tap on, right? So in order to change this information, you want to open up your contacts. So just search for contacts or open up your contacts app on your iPhone. And then once we're here, you're going to see something that says my card at the top and it should say your name. And if you don't see it there, you can just search for your name or create a new contact with your information on it. So all the autofill information is going to pull from your contact information card on your iPhone. So in order to change that, you would just search for yourself or your contact right there so I tap on my contact and then I tap on edit in the upper right hand corner and this allows me to go ahead and change my first and last name but more importantly allows me to change like my email address if I have a home email a work email uh, you know home and mobile phone and then as you can see we can even add our street address down below all of this information can be used for autofill within Safari so in order to do that what we would do is we would go to settings so now open up your settings app on your iPhone and then once here, you want to scroll down to where you see Safari. So here we are under Safari, tap into Safari, and then under general where it says autofill, tap on autofill. And then you see here where it says use contact info. You want to enable that where it's over to the green. And then my info right there where it says your name, if you tap into that, this is where you choose the contact that it pulls from. So for you, you would want it to pull from your contact card. So for me, it's going to be this one here, and that's the one I want to use. Now, a bonus tip is if you want to do this for credit cards, you can tap the enable there next to credit cards and then go to saved credit cards. And then it allows you to use like your Apple card or any other cards that you may have on your device. That's it. That's how you update your autofill information. If you have any questions, please put those in the comment section below and I'll see you guys in the next video.